planning to deliver some beautiful gifts to our friends in the federal building, federal employees who have had their budgets cut, their hours slashed while the Pentagon remains full and satiated on the money of war and military industrial profits. And we do not appreciate that. We do not stand for that. We have values, and our values are family and loyalty. And we believe that the people who work for the federal government deserve to have services and jobs just like all of us. And so we are delivering these beautiful gifts that my friend here will show you. These are peace piggy banks. This is where they can start saving the money. Peace piggy banks. <laughs> peace piggies, yeah. Peace piggies. <laughs> It's a token of our affection on behalf of the Portland citizens and peace community to say, we're on your side. We're not gonna let the Pentagon take all the money in the whole universe to do all their dirty deeds while all the social services get cut, federal government stuff gets cut, your wages, your jobs get cut. So we're delivering these beautiful peace piggies with your messages written inside. Yay! Congressman's office? They're not. No, 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 we know that. We're not going to try to convince somebody on how to vote. We just say no. Who are you trying to get into specifically? Uh, BLM would be a great place to start. Well, you can see, I'll go and see there will be a representative come down and talk to you, but I can't make any promises. Oh, well, we, we just want to give these to whomever is inside. In fact, we give them to you guys if you're the only one down here. So you're not allowing them inside a no, 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 public no. building? No, it's not that. They're just not going to put the deal with it. Well, look, there are things happening in there. Shut the cameras off for the screening section right here, please. Um, so this isn't like the TSA where we're allowed to record it? Okay, I asked you politely, please, just don't film the screening area. So is there a law that we can't record it? The screening section, you cannot record the screening. Yes, constitutional First Amendment rights. And protection of the people and privacy and protection. This elevator is protection. No, I'm not putting Yes. Why don't we step off the elevator for right now until this is dealt with? First Amendment rights. I think that you should have cameras with you. You know what we could do is just when people come down, just give them these from whatever offices. And that way, all you can do is YouTube. While still complaining about our constitutional rights, yeah? Yes. yes. Constitutional yes. rights are being broken. This is ridiculous. I mean, First Amendment. Freedom of the press. With this peace piggy bank and urge you to join the peace movement because in our enlightened self-interest as federal employees, we want the Pentagon budget cut and save all the other budgets. Would you like to? Uh, you don't have to. Uh, no, you don't no. have to. Yeah. Well, thanks for the opportunity. Who do you work for? We'd like to present you with our Well, Forest Service is my choice. Have a good day. You too. Because the Pentagon 
uh, is basically taking all the money and everybody else gets cut a lot yeah, more. Read about it a lot. So we'd Thank like you. to present you with this. If we, you uh, tomorrow, uh, we do have our business hours. You can come to the public desk. Okay. Have a good, good evening. evening. See you on the front lines. Hmm. Much more. What they just take, take, take. From your future, your kids' futures. If we ignore it, it will just go away. <laughs> you can't ignore these. They're so cute. They're cute. <laughs> or if it doesn't go away, uh, this fine gentleman will escort it away. DHS is known for that. Because they're supposed to protect us. No junkets for you. Okay. Yes. I think there's opportunity. <laughs> Johnny, if you need to move back home, I'll take care of you. Yes. Oh, shucks, Actually, Mom. I know as you know, That's the building nice. closes in five, at 5 o'clock. It is 4 Hi, we bear gifts from the Portland Peace Movement. Yeah. So is I'm there one thing we do have rules on? We, we, sure we just need to make sure people have clear access. Yes, yes. So if, um, you know, there's room out front here if you want to, you know, stay here. So at 5 o'clock, I'm going to ask you. Room so who are you, sir? Uh, I'm anonymous. No. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're the one. No problem. That's the problem. This is the guy who's been hacking around. Okay. <laughs> no, no, actually. <laughs> Just um, walked into that one. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right. Excuse me, sir. We'd like to offer you a peace video. It's a gift for you. Okay. Federal employees are just not open to unsolicited gifts. Well, I think oh, that is because that will lose their gifts. job 99% of the time if they side with any side. And that is the oh, coolest man. piece. Of I don't see it on you. So no, I, I have to keep my hands free. So I can <laughs> You've got the most awesome. It would be a safety issue. Okay. All right. But yeah, just make sure people can. Okay. Do you need anything else? Come on, you keep forgetting to put your laundry away. I'm going to have to kick you out eventually. Enough is enough. You know, you keep starting all these rules. Absolutely. We're not blocking your way. Come on through. Have a good evening. We come bearing gifts. Have a good evening. We're from the peace, Portland Peace Movement. Sorry, you guys got to clean this area real quick. Appreciate it. Thank you. Hi, you got one more hand? 
from bearing gifts. This is a piggy bank given to you in solidarity from the Portland Peace Movement. No? All right, have a good evening. <laughs> Are they ours or are they theirs? Can we get John Kerry out of John Mountain? Oh, yeah, okay. Well, okay. Let's not forget him there. We need to forget once he stops in the camera. Yeah, yeah, he's got scary. And I'd just like to say that because of my dear friends and my sweet family, that I am now anti-war. I have served my time out, and I am now pro-peace, and I will strive in every effort to make sure that the peace movement is the voice of the people, and, and recognizing that, and to make sure that nonviolent options are considered and pursued. All of them. That came right out of your mouth, didn't it? <laughs> hey, if you can have a sense of humor in this job, you know. There you go, oh, good yeah, job. <laughs> Yeah, that big new copy, so they're telling me things right there. Yeah. I had a reason for it. Yeah. 